Okay, samurai subnetting. We're going to do a slash 22 here. We're going to slash 22. Um, so uh, we're going to basically subnet a class B address, right? And we're going to find the network address, the broadcast address, the first usable host, and the last usable host. This is on uh, Joey's request. Joey's over here. Can't see him, but he's over there. He's anxiously awaiting this answer. All right. Okay. Slash 22. First, we have to find out. We have to find the magic number. Okay. What is the magic number, Joey? What's the magic number? What's the magic number? Okay. Let's find it. Ready? First of all, let's deal with our subnet mask. Okay, slash 22. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. That's two octets, right? Then that's 16 ones. 17, 18, 19, 20. 21, 22. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Two zeros. And then in the last octet, We've got all zeros. Four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, that looks good. All right, so there it is. 22 ones. One, two, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. Okay, what is the magic number? Four. Louder? Four. Four. The magic number is four. Why? In this octet, this is the octet of interest in this scenario. The third octet is the octet of interest. These are the borrowed bits, right? A normal subnet mask in this situation, a, a normal net mask would have been slash 16, right? Slash 16 would have been normal. Class A subnet mask is slash 8. A class B slash 16. A class C slash 24, right? But instead of slash 16, we borrowed 6 bits and we made a slash 22. The magic number happens to be in the 4's place. How do you find the magic number? You have to know the place values of the 8 bits in binary. Once again, the place values are 8 bits in binary. A 128, 64, 32, can we see that? 16, 8, 4, 2, and 1, right? So we've got 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, okay? All right, if we add that up, It's a 252. So the subnet mask is 255, 255, 252, dot zero. Okay? Right? The magic number is four. All right? What's the magic number? Four. What's the magic number? Four. Okay. What's the magic number, Joey? All right. The networks go up by? Four. The networks go up by four. So that means that the first network is zero. Okay. The next network is four. The ne ne next network is eight. But this is where it gets a little tricky, right? What does that mean? That means 192.168. One nine two dot one six two dot four dot zero is the next network. One nine two dot one six two dot eight dot zero is the network. In other words, the networks go up by four in the third octet. You see that? The magic number is four, meaning the networks go up over here, right? So. The network number goes up by 4 in the third octet. So the next network is 12. The next network is what? 16. Right. So in this scenario, the network is 192.168, no, 162, I'm sorry, dot zero dot zero. Goes all the way to 192.162.0. 
Okay, so the broadcast is 192.162.3.255. Why? What's the next number in the sequence? 192.162.3.255, the next number would be what? 4.0, which is the next network. See that? The first usable host, 192.162.0.1. And the last usable host, 192.162.3.254. Okay, so the network, the broadcast, the first usable host, and the last usable host. Why is that? Because the magic number is 4 and the networks go up by 4. 0, 4, 8, 12, 16, all in this octet, in the third octet. So 3.6 places us in the 0 network somewhere between 0 and 3.255. 0.0 and 3.255. Is that helpful? Money. That's money!